Today I'm going to be playing some of the oldest Roblox games to ever exist, such as this iconic house, this laggy statue, this zombie survival game, and that's just to name a few. Now obviously if you go on the Roblox website itself, a lot of these games either don't work anymore, or just don't let you join at all. But I recently came across this game called Flex's Wayback Machine. It's kind of like Super Nostalgia Zone or Retro Studio, but for a different time period. And yeah, it brings back all these old games just as they looked back in 2006 and 2007. But I think I'm going to start off with Brick Battle Rocket Arena because I've I've got some things I want to say about this game. Let's see how... Oh, jeez. The player list is taking up my whole screen. So here's, here's the thing about Rocket Arena. If you go on Google and search up the first ever Roblox game, it's going to tell you that it's Rocket Arena, but it's, it's not even true, okay? That's one of the many false bits of information that you're going to find from all these AI-generated articles that have just taken over Google search results. But a, a lot of people to this day still believe that this is the first ever Roblox game. So yeah, just, I just I want to set the record straight on that as I spawn kill people in this game. People are getting accused in the chat of being me. If they just looked at who's spawn killing everyone, they'd get their answer. I'm down one arm, by the way. This is this is not going very well for me. Oh, and now I am the one getting spawn killed. I think I I think this is deserved. Or how does this guy have minus 11, minus 12 kills? Can you remove a kill okay so blowing yourself up takes away a kill i guess that makes sense look at this view of the whole map everything is just in shambles right now my game is lagging it's quite the spectacle to see how many people are even in here okay that's a lot of people probably a lot more than 2006 roblox could fit in the server i'm gonna move on to another game because i'm just lagging like crazy now let's take a look at doomspire wars i want to play some 2006 doomspire brick battle Oh, okay. Our bridge is already gone. It's a little concerning. Also, I all I'm hearing is slingshots. Oh! I'm not sure what happened there. Bro, why did I spawn with a brick in my head? Oh, there goes red team. Oh, their whole thing is gone already. Guys, we gotta, we gotta stop blowing ourselves up. We gotta go kill green team, okay? I'm just gonna casually fly on over. And snipe him from... Oh, what what happened to our tower? Oh no. I think uh I think green is going to win. Oh. We all just died. Oh, I'm on the winning team now. Let's go. That was an easy victory. All right, guys, we got to we got to go kill the green team because they won the last game and we we can't let them have that again. All right, I'm just going to Oh. Why am I lopsided? All right, let me let me try that again. Let me just my own teammate blew off my arm. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go to yellow, and then I'm gonna jump over to my death, apparently. This time I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make it this time. There we go. I might as well blow up yellow's base while I'm here. And now I'm gonna go over to green team. All right, we're, we're, I'm forming a truce with yellow. Never mind, I'm dead. Oh no, our tower's falling. It's all right, I clutched it up. We just gotta kill green team. Green team's dead. And we won the game, so it's fine. Let's move on to Sword Fights on the Heights. Very iconic PvP game in the Roblox world. Look, it's even it's even got the music. Oh jeez. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave. Guys, stop fighting! Guys, can we all just get along, guys? Guys, we don't have to we don't have to stab each other. Guys, don't mind me. I'm just uh I'm just a friendly guy who's not gonna stab anyone. And obviously this is the designated spinning area. Oh no. Oh no. They Oh no. Someone had to come along and ruin the peace we had. But yeah, as you can see, the first version of this game was very very bare bones. A lot of stuff like the the elevator and all the areas at the bottom are missing. You only get this default sword. There's no safe zone down here. It's quite a miserable experience based on what's happening over here. Guys, it's Mario. And he's dead. This is the reality that we live in, guys. Look, th these guys are getting along pretty well. Oh. Never mind. It's all it's all ruined. No one is spared from the chaos of sword fights on the heights. Let's check out the Angel of Truth. 
open my place if you want to find out how good your computer is. There's a bit of a Roblox lore behind this game. So if you're wondering what the Angel of Truth even is, it's uh, this statue right here that I mentioned at the beginning. Now it might, it might just look like some random statue, but if you tried to join this game back in the day, there is a chance that it would just crash your computer apparently. I'm not really sure how real that is, but it would definitely make sense considering the time period it was made in. And I believe this wasn't even built in studio, it was just like imported into it somehow. But yeah, that's that's the Angel of Truth lore. And now, now I think I'm just gonna blow it up and delete it. How about Robloxopolis? The Public City Building Project. Read more at... Okay, I'm not sure what that means, but... Oh. That's not a promising sound. Okay, I'm not sure why it says the Public City Building Project. Seems a bit difficult to get any building done in here. Wait, Mr. Beast! Oh no, Mr. Beast is dead at the register. For some reason, I feel like I've seen that before. Look, they even have Mr. Beast working the cash register. Don't shoot me, I have a wall. Why is there a floating torso behind me? Who are you? Oh. Why'd you do that to my wall, man? Well... Unfortunately, there's nothing left of this place, and I'm dead. Bowling ally. <laughs> Roblox police. I'm working on a bowling ally here. Sounds intriguing. Could really go for some bowling ally right now. All right, here we are at the Roblox Bowl. I don't know if I'm seeing things, but it kind of looks like some of the pins are already knocked over. All right, here we go, guys. This is the proper bowling ally technique. What? Oh, I knocked over seven pins. Let's go. It looked like I knocked over zero pins, but it's it's fine. We can we can continue. All right, let's let's get the other three. Okay, let's uh let's oh, I knocked over three. I very clearly knocked over one pin. All right, whatever. We'll we'll take it. I guess. Let's see if I can get a strike. All right, this this is the one. Okay, are, are these bowling pins made out of tungsten? What is that? And yet it says I knocked over eight pins. Can I throw it at the ceiling fan? Nope. All right, well, that was fun. Ooh, they got a zombie survival game on here. Let's see how many waves I can survive. Uh-oh, zombies are coming. Get ready for a fight. Zombies spawn at the graveyard across the map and near players. To use your handgun, you need to get ammo for it. At the end of every wave, boxes containing ammo clips will be airdropped. The last survivor of the round wins and is awarded points. Good luck. Oh, there's the ammo crate. I will gladly take that. Thank you very much. All right, so where... Okay, there they are. All right, that's one. Let's get this guy. Can, can I just kill this one? There we go. And there's one. Oh, there's one behind me. My gun's doing nothing. Oh, geez. Okay, let me let me put a wall down. Okay, that didn't work. Uh, can I punch them? Okay, punching works, and it works quite well, in fact. Oh. Okay, that did a ton of damage. And my my gun is just failing me right now. Oh. What just happened? Clearly I got saved by the bell because I should have died there. I just tripped and fell on the... and fell on the ground. Guys, I made it to wave two and that's all that counts, okay? Lava Rush. This is a very cool game. Okay, so I guess this is some sort of obstacle course type thing. Just have to climb your way up. Seems easy enough. And contrary to what the title says, the lava does not seem to be in any kind of rush. Oh, never mind. Okay, that is, that is pretty fast. I'm gonna have to make this one quick. Oh! Well, I did make it quick, but not in the way that I wanted. It's very hard to do with the old movement because you can't stop yourself in midair. You just, you just fling yourself forwards. All right, this time though, I know what I'm doing. I'm gonna make it to the top before the lava rushes. Look, I'm already at the second stage. The lava hasn't even budged yet. All right, here I think I'm just gonna walk forward. I'm gonna step forward again, jump there. See guys, I'm... It seems like my, um, my wired keyboard ran out of battery, and that's why I died. Guys, it seems like my keyboard is mysteriously breaking itself, and the only way to fix it is to quit playing Lava Rush forever and ever and ever. Guys, I have an idea. So I mentioned Happy Home and Robloxia in the intro, right? And I want to try something out in that game real quick. So you might notice we have a few things in our inventory, but I want to focus on the delete tool. More specifically, I want to summon all of my viewers into this game and see how quickly the whole map gets deleted. Think of it as like a speed run of sorts. Perhaps the first of its kind, I don't know. But everyone's gonna spawn in here shortly, 
And they're already flooding in. Oh! Oh! Yeah, this is, uh... This is definitely a speedrun right now. I can't hear myself over the explosion noises. Oh, everyone's shooting rockets at each other, too. Dude, this is insane. Let me let me get an above view of this. Oh, even the admins joined. This is um, probably the closest thing to pure chaos that you've ever seen. Did we delete everything? I don't think we did. You know, just we'll get a few of these random parts. And I'm not sure what the final time on that was, but... We'll see when I edit this video. Well, thank you guys for participating and watching my massive explosion. I hope you liked that bit.